Darren. Good morning class. Darren, Alexandria, and Clarable, your cousin is here to teach your second period class. How does that sound? That's fantastic. Brilliant. I did not realize you are going to be a teacher, Riley. Good for you, Darren, Alexa, and Clarabelle. And for the rest of you in this class, my name is Mrs. Conklin, and I will be your substitute teacher for Mrs. Davina today. Mrs. Whitaker? Yes, Roselle? Where's Mrs. Davina? Mrs. Davina had practiced a bag-popping trick which blew her left eardrum and she had to go to the doctor to check it out. So Darren, Alexandria, and Clarable, your friend Riley is teaching for us today, and Mau Mau too, you better behave for her. Okay Mrs. Whitaker. Alright class, what are sounds to you? Most likely cartoon sound effects. Okay, Kayla, we know sounds are cartoon sound effects to you and will be cartoon sound effects, always. Who else? What are sounds to you? Stupid. Mau Mau too, you're just afraid. So you lash out. I get you because I was you. Headstrong, full of anger, and a body that looked like it stepped right out of Red Book magazine. Is that good, Mrs. Conklin? Yes, Kolnika, that's good. You don't know. Shut up. You were never me. Oh, now? Look down at your desk. RMC. Riley Melanie Conklin. But weren't you Riley Martin back then and your voice was Kate? Pipster, go to Principal Kiara J. Wolf's office. My desk also has RMC on it. Mine too. They all do. Okay okay, I didn't know where the troublemaker was going to sit. Mr. Bat may have been a bird but at least he wasn't a liar. Well, you better get used to me and Mrs. Conklin because Mr. Bat's in another classroom with Miss Frederick and Mrs. Dvina is out for a blown left eardrum and had to visit a doctor for that reason. <laughs> I know some of you people think this class has nothing to do with your day-to-day -day lives, but you couldn't be more wrong. Sound effects tell the story of our lives. For example, this morning I woke up and it was a sunny day in Grand Junction, Colorado since we moved to that city in a different time zone, which is mountain time. Then I had some tea, which was from China. On my way out the door, a kitty cat which Shelby Rhodes has ran across the piano. Get off of there, kitty cat. Ha 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 ha. Then I drove to work. But then I hit some traffic. Which was caused by a parade. For gay rights. And then I got to school early and had explosive diarrhea in the girls locker room just like Samantha did when she had stomach aches often. <coughs> the end. You suck. <laughs> That's it. Mau Mau too, Mrs. Whitaker and I have both had it. Go to Principal Kiara J. Wolf's office, now. I'm out of here! Okay, for the rest of the class, I will wait for the bell.
and I'll suddenly talk much louder and faster as you're heading out the door okay and we'll be watching a Donkey Kong Country cartoon show tomorrow and learn about Congo Bongo Island. You guys heard Mrs. Conklin, we will be learning about Congo Bongo Island and watching a Donkey Kong Country cartoon TV show episode about it with one episode every day. <laughs> Mau Mau the second, I've asked both Mrs. Conklin and Mrs. Whitaker to be here since it was their class you disrupted. And I regret to inform you that this is your fifth level offensor this year. According to Fraffinity and school policies, five offensor levels mean you're expelled and also your Fraffinity profile will be permanently banned. Are you kidding me right now? Mrs. Wolf, Mrs. Whitaker and I are not sure that's necessary. Too bad. I've made my decision. Now I'm going to know to find Mau Mau, Badger Clops, Boy and Adora Bat about this. Mau Mau, we have overheard from Mrs. Wolf, Mrs. Conklin, and Mrs. Whitaker that you misbehaved today. You are going to get grounded when we get back to Pure Heart Kingdom. And when we get back to Pure Heart Kingdom, you're going to be eating nothing but taffy for every snack and lumpy potatoes for every meal. Let's go back to Pure Heart Kingdom right now. You're going to be grounded when we get there. Oh Jupiter. Can you be 